Well, they dedicate their lives to saving and helping others, but apparently that makes no difference to local criminals. Yeah, first it was Atlanta, now DeKalb County. Crooks are targeting cars belonging to local firefighters, if you can believe that, and officials have had enough. Uh, Fox 5's Denise Dillon is live outside Fire Station 8, and Denise, honestly, this is outrageous. Yeah, it is. It's the kind of thing that really gets you fired up. I mean, these men and women are here to help. They respond to accidents, medical calls. They run into burning buildings, and now they're being targeted by thieves. All around, just disheartening. I mean, again, these are our neighborhood firefighters. Sometime in the middle of the night, thieves broke into three cars parked behind a Cab County Fire Station 8 on Claremont Road. Those cars were the personal cars of the firefighters, the same men and women who put their lives on the line to help others. When they're out there serving the public, uh, being of service to the community, they get the cars broken into. Less than a week ago at this Atlanta Fire Station, about 10 miles away, Eight cars were broken into, all while the firefighters slept. Security cameras caught a guy in the act. An individual was seen jumping the fence and going around checking the vehicles and then breaking the windows out and then throwing whatever he could get back over the fence. Firefighters say a rifle was stolen from one car, a wedding band from another. Atlanta fire officials say it's been an ongoing problem at their stations and changes have been made. There's now razor sharp barbed wire along the fences and security cameras have been added to 14 Atlanta fire stations and more will be added soon. At fire station number eight in DeKalb, firefighters are now parking the cars inside the bay. DeKalb's Captain Eric Jackson says it's frustrating, but also a reality that car break-ins are up across the metro area. It just seems worse when the target is someone who works to help others. For firefighters, once again, we're resilient, we bounce back, and we continue to serve the public as we always do. After the break-in here in DeKalb, the chief put out a directive to all firefighters, lock your doors, make sure there are no valuables in sight, even when you're parked right here on the job. Reporting live in DeKalb County, Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News. That's a shame. Denise, thanks very much.